A tragic end to the search for the second boy in Harlem who went missing over a week ago. Search crews found the body of 11 year old Alpha Barry today. This comes two days after his friend, 13 year old Garrett Warren, was also discovered dead. As CBS 2's Alicia Reed reports, the community is showing up for the families. The community continues to pour into a local mosque to pay their respects and pray with Alpha Barry's family. It's really sad, but uh, through faith and prayer, we are coping as you can see. The 11 year old's body washed up at 102nd and Riverside Drive in the Hudson River Saturday morning. Our thought and prayer. It goes out to the other family. The two boys were last spotted on surveillance near 145th Street and Lenox Avenue after they went missing last week. Alpha, the youngest of six children, is being remembered as funny, bright, and witty. His older brother, Ibrahim, remembers their last conversation where he was working on a Mother's Day gift he never got to finish. He wanted to show his mom how much he appreciates everything that she's doing for them and his siblings. The young boy had dreams of becoming an engineer so he could give back. I'm not going to only be able to make to help myself, but I'm going to be able to help others and also the people in my community. His uncle and brother outside this Bronx mosque tell us they got the dreadful call early Saturday morning. The family immediately rushed to the police precinct. Uh, it, is, it is really uh, difficult, you know. I was able to identify him to be Alpha. I can tell you Alpha was a great kid. He was a very, very great kid, focusing on his education, always by mommy's side. As the family waits to hear Alpha's cause of death, a prayer service is planned for Monday. Now, they do tell me they're holding off on the funeral until his father gets here from West Africa. On the West Side, Alicia Reed, CBS 2 News.